Hi, welcome everyone to econistics.com. Today we are going to study how to import data in Stata platform. So first of all we will go towards Stata. So in this Stata software there are four windows that we need to understand what, what are their functions. So there is a command function that will show all the previous commands that you have used. And this is the command window where you will write your commands or if you want to use functions then you can go in statistics and the functions are there so you can use the functions from the statistics option or you can write commands the data you will import in the stata will be shown here with the variable names and, and the output will be shown in the center window so today we are trying to import a data file and then study how to check if the data file is functioning fine or not and lastly how to uh, describe it as a time series data so this is our data file it has one year one time variable and other is years and then y x1 x2 x3 so there are uh, five six variables so in order to import in it in as data what we have to do is we have to select all of them so we need to remember that there are uh, the first row is the variable name so usually stata likes small variable names so ideally it should be three letters to four letters without spaces without any special characters so that uh, it, because we need to code it so smaller the variable name faster the coding it will be and you can what you can do is you can remember the variable names in the in the word file or you can label it later in the data we can we will see that labeling too so i have copied the data now go in stata so here you need to go in this window so this is data editor edit so when you press it it will open a open a data sheet which looks like an excel file so if i arrange it so in this data file what you have to do is that you have to paste it so that uh, you have to press it here in the first box right click paste it will ask that if you have the first row as a variable name or not so i want to treat my first row as a variable name yes so it will be imported now after the data is imported you need to check few things first all the quantitative variables should be in black okay so have a look one of my variable is in red so there can be few issues related if many one of us sometimes people mistakenly use comma instead of dot or o instead of zero or any other typo in the data so how if the data is long it's very difficult to find where which type of problem it exists so the faster way is just go here see the variable names you write tab x3 the variable name and the tab so it will make a table of the values you can note that there is one na value in it so that was the problem that was uh, uh, making it quanti quality uh, alphabetical alphanumerical so it was it would have uh, so we need to correct it so there are now it's up to you you can either move na in the stata uh, but if you know the correct answer for that so what you what ideally should be done is you need to go in an excel file and correct it so i have the corrected file and copy that so before copying it you need to clear this data so how to clear the data file first of all close the uh, data window and write clear here so it will remove the previous data now go back to excel file copy the corrected data file and then go in the statistics window okay and just paste, paste it here this so data is clear now now if you need to label them so select, select variable here write its label it is dependent variable this way you can label all of your variables okay so this way all the labeling has been done now you need to describe by default stata assumes that this is a cross-sectional data but 
but since this data is arranged in time need to specify it as a time series data so how to specify we need to write a command t double s e t what does it mean it's time series setting and you need to give a time series variable that is here so when you tell it it will be uh, telling us that there is a data is from 1928 to 1960 but with a gap okay so it has understood that it's a time series data but i think there is one year is missing so 1928 if you go here so if you look if there is a missing missing year in it or not so according to stata there is a year missing in this commands so but it will still run so you can see it's 1942 then 1946 there are some years missing in between so that stata is picked up so there are gaps in it but still it will work as a time series data so hopefully you uh, like this video and understood how to import data in Stata. It's very simple, uh, just copy paste. And uh, this way, uh, secondly, uh, there are other ways, but this is the fastest way. And secondly, I, this video also describes the ways to check data if it is imported correctly or not and how to describe it as a time series data. Thank you very much. Do subscribe and share.